everyone this is dr nanya welcome to my channel in today's video i'll be talking about eeg test before beginning this video i'd like you to subscribe to my channel so that i can share all the valuable and useful information with you first of all let us know what is eeg eeg means electroencephalogram it is a test that measures brain electrical signals During EEG, your doctor will place several metal discs on your scalp. These discs are known as electrodes. These electrodes are then attached to a machine which will provide the information about your brain activity. Thus, this can help in diagnosing or monitoring a condition that affects your brain. Now, let us see what is this test used for. Most of the time EEG is done to check seizure activity related to epilepsy. Sometimes EEG is also used during a brain surgery and is also used to check the brain's activity of a person in coma. It can also help in checking the conditions such as Alzheimer's disease, injury to the brain, tumors, and infections such as encephalitis. There are many types of EEG. Let's talk about them. Number 1 is routine EEG. During the test you will be asked to change your breath that is you need to hold your breath or breathe rapidly. You may also be asked to look at the flashing lights. The next one is prolonged EEG. It takes an hour and 15 minutes that is 75 minutes. But in some conditions this EEG can last for several days. This is done to manage or diagnose seizures. The next one is ambulatory EEG. It lasts from 1 to 3 days. Most of the time this test is done at the home. During this test a small recorder will be attached to the electrodes. You will be able to do all your work during the test. The next one is video EEG and the last one is sleep EEG. This is done while you sleep. It is usually done for sleep disorders. This test is not invasive and totally painless. So, how can you prepare for this test? You can wash your hair before the night to take EEG. Also, try to avoid applying products such as hair gel or hair mask. Avoid caffeinated foods and drinks. It also includes energy drinks. Make sure you inform your doctor about all the medications that you are taking including the ODCs that is over the counter pills and supplements. So, are there any side effects of EEG? There are almost no side effects of EEG. This is totally non-invasive and painless. Some people may experience dizziness or seizures during the test. Now let us talk about the results. What may the results mean? After the test is done, your doctor will look at the brain waves pattern. Now, depending on your test reports, your symptoms, and your medical history, your doctor will try to find the diagnosis. Then your doctor might talk with you to develop a treatment plan that works best for you. So it's important for you to talk to your doctor before interpreting your report by yourself and before starting or stopping any medication. It is equally important for you to get tested from a reputed and reliable lab. A link to a reputed and reliable lab will be provided in the description below. If you have any questions or any suggestions, feel free to comment down below. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy.